In half spine twisting pose, it's super important to keep your both hips planted firmly on the floor. That's so that you put the pressure on twisting your spine and not on your sacroiliac joints. So what if you can't keep this hip down? There's an alternative way to do the posture. And first of all, I'll tell you that you should always try this way and see if you can keep that hip on the floor. If you just can't get this hip down, it often helps to straighten out the bottom leg in front of you and then cross the other foot over your knee corner. Now, if you're doing it this way, use your left hand to hug this knee towards you so you can stretch your spine up. And now with both hips on the floor and your spine stretching up, you can wrap your right arm behind you and then do the posture this way. Look over the shoulder twist. Another reason you might use this modification for the posture is if you have a problem with this knee. Usually I would say if you can't bend your knee more than 90 degrees, then you will wanna have this leg out straight. Or if you have any pain in the knee, when you bend that knee, just keep that leg straight out in front of you. Rather than crossing your arm over, you're just gonna use your hand to hug this knee and stretch your spine up. Then right arm on your back, palm facing out, grab the thigh, chest up, spine up, rib cage open, and look over the right shoulder twist. Keeping both hips on the floor, look back and twist. 